channel if you are new here then welcome my name is Sasha Chantel I do vlogs on fashion lifestyle and beauty and if that's your type of thing thank you for stopping by and please do subscribe if you are a subscriber thank you so much for stopping by and continuing support I absolutely love you loads so in today's video I wanted to take you through my perfume collection and just select six of my favorite perfumes I see a lot of videos about perfumes and people's signature scents and I really wanted to share mine because when it comes to perfume I got in on the game very late in life and uh, only as I turned in my 30s did I really take it seriously about finding my signature day and night scent and it's really important as part of your identity as a woman to really just find the scents that really accentuate who you are and represent who you are as a person to the world when they meet you when you meet a person they shake your hand they check your nails but when you enter to a room and you sit down they also smell you when you enter like it's certain things that we when we're younger don't really think about but as we're, oh, I'm older now I realize that that is as just as important as my shoes my nails my hair that literally my scent and how I represent myself is just as important so I wanted to share my six favorite scents and do a bit of backstory about the scents and um, give you a rough idea how much it costs and just mention the keynotes and what things in terms of the ingredients that you can actually find inside the perfumes as well so i actually show you what i've got i've written down the important parts about each perfume i don't want to miss anything i've literally put a lot of effort into choosing my favorite ones and making sure i share a bit of history about the perfumes as well so let us start with the very first one which is a new favorite of mine and that is calvin klein beauty i don't see many vloggers talk about how amazing calvin klein beauty is this scent is so sexy it's so it's so heavy duty the bottle is so beautiful it's got that for me it's got that you can it's perfect for day and it's also great for night it's got a lingering smell but it's not sickly like it's not a sickly smell it really does linger on your clothing if you spray it behind your ear or on your actual wrist like it stays there for hours and you don't have to reapply i don't know if i have found a better perfume yet and it's so affordable so literally i got this for 28 pounds on groupon which is crazy but obviously on perfume shop and other online stores you can get it for different prices but for a name brand like calvin klein um just want to mention the top notes are citrus um cocktail orange blossom and the base notes are said um cedarwood and amberette seeds absolutely gorgeous um it's heart notes are jasmine and neo lily and it represents femininity and sophistication to be honest i have to say i 100 percent agree with that this perfume is just it's one that i wear daily and i've been spraying it for a long time had it for about six months so i've had this perfume for about six months and i use it daily like i use calvin klein beauty daily and when i say i am in love with this perfume it's mad the fact that it's so affordable but so classy and it's such a heavy duty bottle like i don't want to say it could double up as a weapon but my god like it really could <laughs> but honestly guys it's so sweet but it's not a sickly sweet and i have to when things are sweet it can be a bit sickly it can be a bit overbearing calvin klein beauty is not that it is such a nice sensual feminine um, scent and it's just one that i honestly reach for every single day and oh god i love it honestly if you don't want to spend 
too much money and you have a tight budget but you want to have that level of class and sophistication and be like walk into a room and people smell you and they remember you then to start off your perfume collection if you haven't started one already get calvin klein beauty like it's beautiful the bottle is beautiful it's a gorgeous gorgeous perfume and the size is amazing like i think this is a 500 ml i think but i will put the actual sizing on the links below because me and my sizing has never makes any sense basically but honestly it's a gorgeous perfume and a great one to start your collection up if you are like me a late bloomer and need to start somewhere start off with this one okay so it's a highly recommended must purchase add to collection perfume so that's the first one and then the next one let me get my notes because i don't want to miss nothing how on my perfumes okay so the next one is um vera wang by vera wang okay so this is another one that i got from groupon i was really desperate to get myself on that perfume ladder that sophisticated perfume ladder but again keep it to a reasonable price point and not spend too much money but at the same time come back with name brands that are recognizable and that put quality into what they do so oh god the vera wang by vera wang perfume is beautiful so let me read some stuff about it and um, it's considered to be the ultimate wedding perfume there is no shop there it is so nice it's clean smelling like imagine fresh linen that's the kind of smell you're getting it's really fresh really sensual it smells like you know like independent woman like but also the whole idea of it being a bridal perfume it's got that element to it as well it's really fun fresh refrigerating it's just it's a beautiful scent the bottle is also another heavy duty bottle its top notes are lily heart notes are white um stephanis whatever that says um base notes are sheer musks no doubt there musk is such a big thing for me when i was younger my mum used to always wear musk like vanilla musk all the time and it's got actual remnants of that in this amazing perfume um and it's it's described as flirtatious fun sensual it really is all those things when i spray this on myself i feel those that energy coming from it it's got that it's sophisticated and classy but it's also fun and playful it's that kind of perfume again it's quite sweet but it's not a sickly sweet it lingers you spray it behind your ears particularly and it does linger throughout the day if someone hugs you or kisses you they're going to notice that you've got this perfume on and it's a classy perfume and for me it's perfect for daytime like it's a perfect daytime scent but again it can double up as an evening perfume too honestly i am in love with vera wang by vera wang one of the best perfumes i've ever bought and one that i will continue to buy once it's finished like it's definitely a replenisher like you have to buy this one again beautiful scent so if you don't ever know about vera wang by vera wang get to know it's absolutely amazing so that's number two number three it it had to be on my list it's another calvin klein but this time it's obsession so no pun intended but i'm definitely obsessed with this perfume before i knew about the other ones i thought about and learned about calvin klein obsession top notes and mandarin the bottle is it feels quite masculine to me the bottle like it looks like a very masculine bottle but it's still a good perfume for women um it's heart notes of exotic spices which is no shock there because it does smell very exotic I imagine like you know like being in the jungle um being with like the man of your dreams chasing you through the jungle and you have a good time this is the kind of scent you be wearing when that happens <laughs> like it's just so nice it's so strong and it's like a, it's really strong but again it's not a kind of strength that's like Ew, yucky it makes you feel a bit because you know sometimes like you meet people and they come into your space and it's like overwhelming it's like overpowering scent and it's a lot and they've like doused their whole body in it obsession is one of them perfumes that you don't have to spray spray you don't have to spray much to make a difference like you only spray have to spray a little bit in your certain pulse points and it's gonna be perfectly fine so oh uh, oh it's beautiful you know so these base notes are oriental amber um 
the key fact about it was launched in 1985, which is, was the year I was born. So it's 36 year old perfume. It does not get old. Listen, nothing beats Calvin Klein obsession. Oh, it's the kind of scent that you do get obsessed with. Once you smell it and you keep smelling it, you keep like inhaling, you want to take more and more and more. It's that kind of scent. If you haven't bought Calvin Klein Obsession at least once, there's something not quite right, honestly. They describe it as a sexy, provocative scent. There's something very sexy about this scent that definitely, it does hit that on the head, like completely. You can like smell all the bits of what it says in there, the exotic spices, the amber. It can smell every single element in this perfume. It's beautiful and it is long lasting and it's it's a unique blend of vanilla and amber so anything of vanilla I kind of like gravitate to because I'm a big fan of vanilla I love vanilla I love mask I love the combination of the two and it's just one of those scents that again if you spray it on your clothes it just be on your clothes the whole day you spray it on your coat you spray it on the label of your coat and it's done like it's such a beautiful mature scent I feel like for me it suits a more mature woman obsession compared to a young girl so if you're like 20 19 20 you probably wouldn't gravitate towards obsession the way an older woman a more mature woman like in your 30s and stuff would gravitate to it I do think the scent does match an older woman I'm not sure why but that's just how I feel wearing it I don't imagine that I'd wear it at the age of like 20 or whatever because when I was young, I used to wear like Charlie Red. And if you're like a Charlie Red gang, like get at me. You know what I'm talking about. But it's just beautiful, literally. It's so deep. I think the best way to describe it is so deep. The perfume is deep. And as you inhale it, it gets stronger and stronger and stronger still. So you could, if you like, on the first smell, you'll smell it. And it's like you haven't taken it all in. You've got to do it again. You've got to inhale it one more time. So yeah. So Calvin Klein Obsession is another one of my favourites and definitely one you need to add to your collection if you're trying to start your collection up or if you haven't got it, you have a collection, add that in there, it's a must. So we're halfway through. So my next one, I'm gonna leave it till last but it's my favourite, I thought I'd like to show it off now. And I have put up a post about it on my Instagram, it is Tom Ford Black Orchid. Seriously, like, this is a unisex um, perfume so men and women can wear it. When I say this perfume is just so, it's just opulence, it's high, it's high fashion, it's high stakes. You feel so powerful and sexy and sensual and like elegant and like when you wear this scent, there's no doubt when people hug you or greet you, and I've had that from experience, when you put on this perfume and you smell it, geez, like, and someone else smells it, they question you like, oh, you're wearing black orchid, isn't it? I've had that so many times. People said to me, you're wearing black orchid? Because it's that kind of, it's something you remember. Once you smell it once, you don't forget the smell of black orchid. Like, let me just go through what's in black orchid. Because seriously, this perfume is like a life changer. Like, it changed the way I saw perfume. So, it is a unisex fragrance. It's sexy. It's sophisticated. The black bottle with the gold detailing is just like an extra. It works for both sexes. Like, men and women can respect and enjoy and love what this beautiful fragrance is about it's top notes of jasmine gardenia black currant lemon bergamot mandarin look how much things are in that top note like it's an a, it's abundance of different flavors and scents like smashed together but it works i get excited about this because no matter where i go and i wear this i get comments i've never not gone somewhere and worn this and someone say to me are you wearing tom ford like it's never happened because it stands out it is that scent um it's base notes are um, patchouli sandalwood incense amber chocolate and vanilla which is mad what a combination and it's bottled in a fluid black glass and it represents glamour there's no doubt about it it's hollywood it's high fashion it's high style it's celebrity this is the perfume that I imagine that everyone in that kind of circle would wear. And it's not about trying to keep up with those certain people, but sometimes you should literally level up the way you wear scents. And when you go out with your friends and you go out for a night out and whatever, you wanna smell good, you wanna smell classy, you wanna like turn heads. And without a doubt, Black Orchid is the perfume that you need to have to help you do all those things, like it's a fact. Absolutely love it and it's one that I, it's 50 millilitres and when it's finished I will buy a new one and it's one that I can't be without like it's a staple in my collection I have to have it there at all times 
and it has to be there like it's like i know so much people will actually get my excitement because it is a head turner this perfume is everything so black orchid in my collection absolute must now my next one is perfect by market J market mark jacobs so perfect the bottle is gorgeous first and foremost that's the first thing you pick up on how pretty the bottle is it is perfect no pun intended not to sound too corny but it's absolutely oh okay it's a beautiful bottle it's playful it's fun it's feminine it's girly it's all those things it's really cute it's a nice size the scent is inspired by Mark Jacobs' mantra, which is, I am perfect as I am. Honestly, I feel this bottle, it's everything but its perfume represents that. When I wear it, it's not in the daytime, but I do wear it at nighttime as well. When I spray it, I feel really good in myself. I feel like I'm in touch with who I am as a person. It's like, how can the perfume do that? It can, because it represents you. Like, as I mentioned in the beginning of the video, when you wear a scent, it represents you. When you step into a space with people and they smell you when you enter, that's your representation of you. And I feel like if you've got to wear anything, Black Orchid or Perfect by Marc Jacob is the ones to start on because they are fantastic scents. So this is made up of juicy notes of rhubarb, daffodil and almond milk, which is a really cool combination. It's so nice. Again, it does linger, it does last. It's not a sickly sweet. It's very sweet, I'd say, like, and I feel it's more suited to daytime than it is suited to nighttime. That's just my opinion. I like to wear it in the daytime when I'm going out and about and it has drawn attention. People have said to me, what are you wearing? And I'm like, oh, I'm wearing Marc Jacobs Perfect, you know, isn't it lovely? <laughs> but spring it on my cardigan, spring it on my, on my neck, spring it behind my ear, like it does it. It does everything. This was a gift from my, my partner, my ex-partner. A perfect gift name is makes great you know it's the best gift and I now will continue to buy this in the future because this perfume is just absolutely everything and it's got base notes of cedar, cedar wood and like I said it's a daytime fragrance if you're gonna wear this I would say oh god it's clean like you know you get the shower and then you wanna spray something. After you do your body spray and your deodorant, you wanna to top up with your, your scent for the day. Like the Perfect by Marc Jacobs is that scent. It's your daytime scent. It carry you to work, carry you to uh, drinks out with your friends after. And it could be an evening scent too, but for me, it's my daytime. I reach for it more in the daytime. And it's just a beautiful, beautiful scent. Absolutely gorgeous. And one that I'm sticking with in my collection. I can't be without it. And last but not least, by any means, by any means, Chanel number five. We are literally three quarters through this amazing classic perfume, one I cannot live without, one that I dreamed about when I was younger but couldn't afford to buy and I begged my aunt to buy it because she always used to buy me the expensive um, presents and she paid a hundred something pound at the time to get me this and I've held on to it like literally I've held on to this perfume with all my life like my all my might all my all my energy I've been clinging on like I'm not gonna let it I don't use it for no reason apart from special occasions it's a special occasion perfume through and through it's a special occasion perfume it's so amazing they say it's the essence of femininity and to be fair there is no perfume better than Chanel number no. five I don't care what no one says. This is not even something to negotiate or this this argue about. It's not it's non-negotiable at this point in time. Like nothing beats number five. Nothing, nothing. It is. Oh flipping hell. Oh, it's so. It's like a powerful powerful floral bouquet of like florals. Like it's just bare flowers. But I've got to spray a bit. I've got to spray a bit. Mm. Mm. like I went out years ago I was talking about like six seven years ago to an event and I made sure I sprayed this all over I was going I was going deep because I was going somewhere really special and really posh and I was in the elevator with somebody and they're just going around are you wearing Chanel number five it's like Chanel number five of course it's Chanel number five <laughs> When you wear this, no one's gonna mistake anything else. No one's gonna confuse what you're wearing with anybody else because this is the scent. This is the classic 
one of a kind, never nothing made after it like it, scent, like through and through. It's a timeless, iconic perfume, through and through. Your collection is not a collection by any means until you have a bottle of Chanel Number no. 5 inside that collection. I don't care what no one says, you can't attack me, I'm just the messenger, I'm delivering the fair and truthful news. Like, this is the perfume you've got to have in your collection. It's also, um, it's, the, it's an iconic bottle. Like, if you do not have Chanel Number no. 5 in your collection, wake up like just come to your senses come back you know stop buying them celebrity brands buy this stay with your coins buy chanel number five it's the one you need to have it's it's absolutely beautiful like i'm so grateful for my aunt for buying this for me it's a scent that i just cannot ever be without i it literally makes my collection feel more you know it's so representative as of me as a woman and how important it is to smell good and look good and feel good in myself and when i wear chanel, chanel number five out and about i do feel all those emotions of confidence i feel sexy that self-esteem that energy is positive you know i'm gravitating i'm giving out good vibes i'm getting good vibes back it's like it's a perfume i know but really like your perfumes can do so much for you it does so much for your confidence. It does so much for your self-esteem. It does so much for how you present yourself to the world. And I'm so happy that I got into perfumes and started to take it more seriously and stopped buying cheap ones because cheap ones do not last. Cheap ones do not stay on your clothing, on your skin. They fade and you have to keep reapplying, reapplying, reapplying. If a good quality perfume, you don't have to keep reapplying. You put it on once and it goes on throughout the day or night. And that's what we're looking for in a good perfume collection. Done, nothing else to say, nothing else to add. If you enjoyed this video and you love the perfumes or you think there's other ones that I should be having in my collection that I've missed, please do comment below. But if you enjoyed the video and you want more like these, please do give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't, stick with me on my YouTube journey. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Take care, bye.